finished giving him a bottle now. I just heated up my leftover breakfast from yesterday and added some salsa to it. It doesn't look very appetizing on the camera, but it's really good. Um, and then I was about to make a breakfast smoothie also, since there's not very much here. I was like starving last night. It was crazy. Like, I don't know if I just didn't eat enough yesterday because I was like doing so much. I woke up like so hungry like I could eat a full like plate of food like I think I woke up at uh, around 7 and ended up just having to eat a bowl of cereal and a banana because I was just so hungry like I couldn't go back to sleep and then I don't think I went back to sleep after that anyways so it's been a rough night I barely slept at all and I woke up super early and then the rescue people called me at around 10 so I talked to them so hopefully we can get um, an appointment scheduled this weekend to visit with the puppy um, this one's a German Shepherd puppy and I just had to send in pictures of like the yard um, for the foster home to like take a look at and make sure that they're okay with us taking the puppy and then we would have to do like a meet with the puppy and the foster parents um, for us to see if we like the puppy and then vice versa. Um, the foster parents as well. I just finished kind of organizing the living room a little bit. I've got some dishes to do in here, but I'm just so tired right now. I'm just gonna hold off on that for a little while. My dad's coming today. Um, he was supposed to be heading down here at around noon, but I guess um, at the he's at the cabin right now and I guess the city has electrical got turned off for a certain amount of time. I don't know what they were doing, but I guess he got a notice and forgot. So he wants to wait until after the power turn gets turned back on because he wants to like vacuum and do stuff using electricity to clean for the next runners coming on the second, I think is when they're coming. Um, they're staying for like 4th of July weekend. Um, and then he's gonna head down here and he's probably gonna stay down here for a few days. Um, so he'll probably be with us for the holiday. And I think we're gonna go over to Scott's house, just have like barbecue and fireworks getting sick of the toy already. I just gave it to him like five minutes ago. He probably needs to go down for a nap soon. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna probably edit some videos right now. Hopefully he goes to sleep so I can edit, um, make my shake really quick because I'm so hungry still. And um, yeah, that's it. Scott's taking a nap right now. He just got home. I think he got, I don't even know what time he got home, like six or seven. So he's in the bedroom sleeping. But now my food is cold, so I'm gonna eat it now. Hey guys, so we've just been hanging out. What's mom doing? What's she doing? Little booger just spit up all over dad, so he's about to go take a shower. Did you do that to dad? Did you do it to dad? That's so funny. It's so funny. You're such a happy boy right now, huh? So I've been talking to like people from rescues all day today and like we've been looking at puppies at different rescues. It's like more difficult to adopt a puppy than it is to buy a house it seems like. Or it's about comparable. That's my phone. This might be another rescue. It. That might have been another rescue. They always have like weird area code numbers. Um, but anyways, I finally organized his bedroom and I just finished cleaning the kitchen and doing the dishes and I've got some shepherd pie 
in there that I just made. I'm not really sure why I put it in like little individual cupcake tins, but that's what it is. So my dad should be here soon. Me and Scott are probably gonna eat as soon as he gets out of the shower though. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Grandpa's so excited to give you your puppet. He's so excited to give it to you. This is probably a rescue. So. Hi, this message is for Crystal. This is Lauren uh, with West Coast Boxer Rescue. Uh, you have an application on file with us, and I'd like to review that with you. I'm going to get you approved. If you could call me back at 510-295-3682. I'm off work until Tuesday, so you can call me anytime until then. I don't care for you soon. Bye-bye. Another one. So... It doesn't look very organized right now, but it's getting there. So these are the two that I'm going to return because I want to get um, this one instead. I like these ones. These are all the ones we're going to put in the shed because these are like newborn ones and twos that don't fit anymore. And then I organized everything in here. So he's just got the two bins that he's going to grow into. This is the one that needs to go out to the garage, but I need to get a bin from Target. And then these are all the infant inserts in his infant tub that need to go out too, but I need a bin for that also. I ordered his sheets already, but I um, need to get a mattress, but I just saw the like safe sleep uh, mattress. They're really expensive, but they're like made so that it has like, um, it's like a box. <laughs> it prevents this from happening. We don't put our face into the bottom of the couch, little monkey. That's how we suffocate. So this is why I want it <laughs> for this exact purpose. You turn over, little baby. You turn over and stop putting things in your face. You've got boogers all over. You've got boogers all over, little baby. Oh my gosh, you're a booger monster right now. So basically, it's like a wooden box, and then it has like um, an empty space, so it's like oxygen-rich air in between the bottom and then the top. That's like a mesh mattress topper. So if they go on their face, they can breathe the oxygen, and they're not like gonna suffocate. I guess it was made by like three people. Um, there was like a pediatrician, an interior designer, and I can't remember the third one, um, but I guess they all lost children from flipping over and suffocating, which is really sad. So I guess they got together and they made this. Um, it runs anywhere from like 275 up to like 700 I think, for them, um, but the sale ones were like 275 and I'm like, well, I mean, if it's worth like his safety, like, I feel like it's worth it. But I did just buy these crib sheets um, that they wouldn't work on, so we'll see what happens. I might have to return them. What do you think? What do you think? Look at those boogers. Look at those boogers. Monkey. I just got off the phone with Grandpa. I hear him. The parrot is announcing your entrance. Oh Jeez, gosh. Love. Happy to. You better get in here before the fleas jump on you. <laughs> hey, buddy. What are you doing? <laughs> Who looking, is that? He's looking at you for. Is it okay? Who is that? Okay. I'm gonna get the puppet. Uh oh. Uh oh, here comes the puppet. Are you ready? Monkey, Grandpa's getting your lion. Are you excited? Are you excited? Are you excited to see your present? Yeah.
You excited to see it? I'm glad you're in a good mood because it's nap time for you. It's past your nap time. Here it comes. I hear it. I hear it. What's it gonna be? <laughs> that looks kind of creepy. Hang on. Hang on. This is new to me. Oh dear. I gotta do it with my left hand because this one doesn't bend anymore, so I had to change, change the things. <laughs> Put them up. Put them up. Put them up. <laughs> yeah, he hasn't seen the Wizard of Oz yet. Put him, put him up. What is that? Up. Put him up, put him up. Is that a lion? <laughs> He's like, I don't know what to think. Put him up, put him up. Hiya, buddy. Hiya, 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 hiya. <laughs> what is that thing? <laughs> put him up, put him up. He looks like he's not sure if he wants to cry or not. <laughs> I know. Are you going to be okay? Is it too much too soon? What is that? Put him up, put him up. <gasps> is it a lion? Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> put him up, put him up. Put him up, put him up. Put him up, put him up. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. Uh oh I gotta back up a little bit. He's starting to get a little confused. It's okay, monkey. Hey, put him up, put him up. Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> Can I move him for the kill? He doesn't know. <gasps> I'll get, let me get close to you first. Put him up, put him up. Look at the hey, lion. Put him up, put him up, put him up. Oh, yeah, he's laughing at him. Oh. We like him. You want to see him? Put him up, put him up. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. Are we going to go for this? Look at my Yeah, buddy, 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 buddy. Look, got the tail. Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> oh, oh. oh. <laughs> oh, you're okay. You're okay. You're fine. It's okay. Okay, back to normal. We're okay now. We're okay now. Okay. It's past his nap time. I've noticed he's been getting like overstimulated lately. That's okay. He'll get over it. It's actually better. We'll put him right there for now, okay? Okay, here's your gift. That's not yours. I was like, what is this? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's somewhere. What do you think? Yeah, I don't know what this thing is either. What is Griffin doing out there? Okay. <laughs> you're, you're gonna like this. Okay, I got this from uh, this little small town. It's really cool up there. I can't remember, I can't remember names up there. And uh, when I was over there in uh, what town, what state was I in? Colorado. But, but anyway, I got this in Colorado for you. <laughs> but it doesn't have any noise. So what I did oh, no. is I opened up the back and stuck a noise inside. <laughs> So when you do when you're upset with Scott, this is what you get. <laughs> it sounds like the parrot next door. Anyway, so I, I opened it up. You can take it out if you want. I don't care what you do. Or but you, if you're gonna leave it in, you need to sew this back up. You can sew, right? Yes. Okay. There you go. What do you think of that? Oh, this one you want to touch. You want to touch the other one? No, this one's mine. You can't have that one. It's pink. It's for a girl. Her name is Sherbert. Her name is Sherbert. Hey, Sherbert.
a toy. Oh, hi, lion. Hi, lion. Hello, Mr. Lion. Learned how to like touch things that he tries to touch. That's so cool. Isn't that cool? <laughs> it's really cool. Oh, he likes it now, huh? Yeah. He likes touching anything. He's in his like sensory phase right now. <laughs> now, Troy's all kinds of made all kinds of, them, but I picked that one out. The other one, and actually, the girl that was with Iceman said she picked that one out too. I said, Yeah, that's the one I was going to pick out. Well, his like bedroom is like supposed to be like safari suit themed, so lions work perfect. <laughs> okay. So I just got off the phone with one of the rescues. It was a uh, one of the boxer rescue people, and they said that they had a puppy. It's so sad looking at all the rescue Don't throw dogs. Don't my puppy away. <laughs> Go ahead. Um, so they have a puppy that's like ten weeks old. But they said that I guess the previous owners that they got the dog from. Um, they put a collar on the dog and they never like loosened it as the puppy grew. So the collar grew into the dog's neck. Oh my god. And it had to be surgically removed. And oh my it just god. got out of surgery and it's like recovering now. Oh my god. What is wrong with people? I mean, boxers are great dogs, but you really need a watchdog. That's what you need. Let's just get a lion. Let's get a real lion. Can we get a real lion? Yeah. <laughs> Are we okay now? Now we're, we're okay. Now we're okay. This is what he does every time someone comes over now. Christine and CJ, every time they come over now, he like starts screaming, crying, because they're like, oh, hi. Yeah, no, no, and then they like, can't do that. Because ten minutes that, later, he's fine and smiling. You did the exact the same thing. You'd be sitting in a restaurant and the wait, because you were a cute kid, so the waiters would always come, oh, what a pretty baby. And you go, ah! <laughs> so we couldn't take you in your, to a restaurant. That's what I mean. You have to not be like me. You have to be like happy baby for everybody. Just leave. Oh, I got one more thing. Morning. I got to get it. Forgot about it. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Don't Okay, buddy. We gotta get you ready. I should probably cut the string shorter so he don't kill himself. You should hang it on his um, uh, changing table. Okay. You think that's better? Mm hmm. In there more than ever? He likes to play with things on his changing table. Okay. That's where your monkey is right now. He always rips the monkey off and plays with it when I change him. Okay, so where should I hang it? Found this? Will it hang all the way from, no, it'll be too, not long enough if we hang it from the ceiling, huh? How heavy is it if it falls on his head? <laughs> that was light. Yeah, you got light. Yeah, just hang it from like, I don't know. In the middle? You know, these things. Well, it like. Yeah. How long do you want it? Do you want him to be able to like, touch it? Yeah. And then you'd probably need to lower it to like, here maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Just leave it, just uh, don't cut it, just leave it to that. Okay, because you can take a yeah. change later, okay. Because maybe we could use it like when he starts sleeping in the crib. Old? No. Okay, well you can change it. He'll probably hit it. Yeah, he loves your monkey. Every time he gets his diaper changed, he grabs the monkey and plays with it. Yeah? <clears throat> it's his favorite toy. <clears throat> I think he like. I think he likes blue. We gotta get the the teddy bear. Oh, we should ask Alex. Yeah, we can go get it anytime. Where, where, wherever's best for you. We'll go get it, then we'll go to locksmith and open it. His first baseball. <coughs> Say thanks, Grandpa.
Can't get it. Okay. That thing up, and then you take out what you want. I put his, all of his uh, like hospital stuff oh, in the cool. in the frame. Oh, he's got a little hat and everything. Huh? That was his uh, hospital hat. Oh yeah, they gave it to you. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. A little footprint. Those were the the shoes that he he wore leaving the hospital. The little Converse. <laughs> Who gave you those? I think I bought them like at the store somewhere. Yeah. But Scott loves his Converse, so he said that those had to be his. Where's all this? That was from his baby shower. Everybody oh. wrote their name and put a fingerprint. I don't think you did yours. Yeah, I don't even remember it. It was at the game table. Yeah, I didn't even see it. I think I still have all the ink and stuff. Oh, and did you see my gallery wall that I did? Did what? My gallery wall that I did. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Everything looks better. You More organized. Of, uh, empty boxes everywhere. Yeah. Look at we finally got some bar stools, even though they're too short. Oh, yeah. I just wanted something because it'll give like some extra seating for people that come over. Yeah. Even though they don't, they don't go high enough. That's like the highest bar stool you can get. <clears throat> yeah, these are. I don't know what the stool. I don't know why they made it so tall. I think it's because of the stove. Yeah. yeah, but they still could have made it shorter. Oh yeah, the stove was stuck up. Yeah. Well, that's cool. Are you not going to take a nap? 